mga kada nitong nakaraan lang po ay nag-ingay sa social media ang mga katagang very demure, very mindful, very cutesy na pinauso ng isang content creator mula po sa Amerika. Na dito rin sa kada umaga, di ba meron tayong episode last mm, week? Yes. Eh, binanggit-banggit din natin yan. Kaya dapat nanonood kayo. At ilan din sa mga... <laughs> kaya din natin. Kaya din natin. <laughs> At ilan din sa mga sikat na celebrities, mapalokal man yan at international, ay ginawa pa ang TikTok trend na ito. At syempre, sabi ko nga po, hindi kami magpapatalong tatlo. Kaya mga kada, panoorin po natin ito. Let's try to make some spamasubi. Okay, so here I am cutting some seaweed, looking very cutesy and demure. Demurely putting uh, Japanese me on my fingers because I'm super mindful that if I don't do that, the rice will stick to my fingers. And do you like this breakfast, Buki? It was so yummy! Mmm, delicious! Where did you first eat this? Um, in Japan. Yeah, I remember we bought it from a, a vending machine. Ah, no, it was from like a convenience store, a kombini. Yeah. And then we shared it in on the plane, right? Yeah, it was actually really yummy, but I just didn't really like the egg and the mayo. So I put little mayo for you here. Being very mindful that Brooklyn doesn't like Japanese mayo too much. But here it is. Here's Ate. Very demure, very cutesy. Taking a bite. And the rating is. And now, very mindful that Brooklyn is still videoing her and getting mad. <laughs> What are you doing, Diana? I'm watching a movie. Oh. Hmm. Very wow. Demure. Very demure. Very mindful. Very mindful, Very yeah. Cutesy. Oh, wow. Hmm. Take a big deal first. You see how I do my makeup for work? Very demure, very mindful. I don't come to work with a green cut crease. I don't look like a clown when I go to work. I don't do too much. I'm very mindful while I'm at work. See how I look very presentable? Very demure, very mindful, very cutesy. I don't do too much. I'm very mindful while I'm at work. See how I do this when I drink from the bottle? Very demure. Very mindful. I don't just chug it. I just don't. All the way down is little, little by little. Very elegant, swelling it, demure, mindful. Straight hair, very demure. Wearing a seatbelt, very mindful. If I could paint a perfect picture of a girl of my dreams with a curvy figure. Voice of an angel like a symphony. No doubt she's a masterpiece. At para mas matulungan po tayo, maging more demure, more mindful, and more cutesy. <laughs> Pwede ba yun? Let's welcome a life coach at nagbabalik dito pa sa kada umaga, si Coach Ellen Perez. Good Hi, morning, Coach. Coach. Good morning. Hi. It's Good. been too long. Yeah, we miss you, gorgeous ladies. It's nice to be back here in the share ko lang dito sa kada. Very mindful, very cutesy, <laughs> and very demure. Aww. <laughs> very mindful kami, Coach, na last tayo nagkita, eh, lima pa yata kami. Para, yes, oh, diba? So, mga yes, super, super I remember super that. Natin. Yes, <laughs> and thank you. I'm happy to be back with this topic that's very close to my heart, and uh, yeah, one of my favorites being mindful. Oh, oh. ito bang mga konsepto na to, coach, since ito ay nauuso uh, lately, is there anything new about them? Basically, um, something new about it is that the content creator or the people are doing this in the social media and putting it in hype. It's about uh, using terminologies that's easy to grasp by the young generation mm -hmm. or the generation of today, should I say. And at the same time, kahit yung mga mommy, diba, o yung mga... Uh, 
kabataan or yung mga working people would be able to adapt to it easily and understand it. It's in a nutshell, uh, hindi ko na patatagalin, it's more on being a uh, powerful because yun nga, as I always say the mind is the machine of the of our body it dictates your motion and emotion and that's how powerful our mind is and so it's thinking about it's draw uh, it's bringing us to becoming having that growth mindset mm -hmm. hindi ka lang positive mm. growth mindset kumbaga adaptable ka cautious ka sa sasabihin mo, sa gagawin mo, mm -hmm. mindful, ganon. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, um, andun yung uh, attitude mo na, o teka, have fun as well. Mm -hmm. uh, bakit sa tingin mo bigla itong pumatok? Kasi parang ako kasi, ang dating sa akin ito is medyo counter-cultural mm. in an age where Diba? The louder, the better. Mm. The more boisterous, the better. Yes. Mas maingay, mas yes. popular. Mm. Para siyang kumukontra mm. dun sa popular uh, na, uh, dun sa parang wave of... Uh, the... Na mas maingay ka, kailangan mas bongga. Oh, ganun, para mas no? mapapakinggan. Mas, mas, mas mapapakinggan ka. Yeah, it is becoming appealing, I think, because yung ating generation of today, it's more of a smart working in, in terms of working style in their yun din sa pag-aaral and it's encouraging in a way that it's telling you that you make your you make your success out of your silence which is not very common these days yes, diba? Diba? So, yung diba. parang ina uh, pinapakita mo sa social media yung ginagawa mo ano yung mga tipong accomplishment mo achievement mo pero hindi bragging or mm. hindi ka boastful mm -hmm. or hindi yung parang dapat magarbo yes. para maging Okay, or mm -mm. Ka, kapansin pansin. Mm -mm. Pwede ba natin isa isahin, Coach? Yes. Mayroon na tayo sa very demure. Pag mm -mm. ba sinabi nga, very demure, paano ka dapat mag-act? At ano bang ibig sabihin nito? <laughs> ayan na, ayan. <laughs> na, hindi lang talaga siya sa... Yung Ngayon pag... lang yan. Ngayon <laughs> lang yan. <laughs> <laughs> hindi lang siya yung sa pagkilos talaga. It's also, you know, um, becoming a discipline. When you start to be... Uh, hindi rin siya yung parang reserve ka naman o parang natatakot kang oh. i-project yung or sarili mo. Or totoong demure. Oh, oh. <laughs> hindi rin naman yung masyado kang parang uh, you're like... Uh, stiff. Stiff. Mm. Oh, oh. Thank you for the word. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just, you know, um, cautious ka, di ba? Like for instance, cautious. as they, yeah, cautious ka. As they would say, if you don't have anything good to say, might as well... Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Not That's being demure. Ha? Oh. You know, you, you, you Hindi talaga can... Hindi uso yan these days. Oo, oh, kung wala ka rin naman <laughs> parang... ipopost na maayos at oh. makaka-empower or magka-encourage, huwag oh. ka na lang din magpopost kung puro oh. rant, ba? Diba? Mm -hmm. That's also becoming demure. demure. You're low-key. Oh, oh. Even a corporate setting, uh, the trend now for leadership is uh, becoming low-key or low demure. Laid back. Laid okay. back. You don't highlight your... You don't flashes all your achievements or accomplishments, but you highlight the achievements of your managers, your mm. downline, because, of course, their greatness reflects of who you are as a leader. And that's mm -hmm. becoming a demure leadership. So it's something new as well now. Kasi parang dati, di ba kailangan ibida mo to, iboka mo to, ipakita mo lahat to, right? Yung, yeah. yung talagang sinisigo mo, nagawa mo to, ganyan, ganyan. Sabi all. nga dito sa definition, Nahango pa sa 15th and 16th centuries. Ang demure daw ay salita na ang ibig sabihin ay hiding a darker version of themselves. Hindi ba to ano, parang mapanding la yeah. lang? It's most likely, noong panahong yan, ganon ang ibig sabihin ng demure. <laughs> diba, demure? Kasi ngayon na, hindi na siya ganon naaangkop. Ngayon, pagka, may, medyo positive connotation, con connotation. Positive connotation ang, ang demure. demure. Kasi, ibig sabihin, nag-iisip ka, Ate ka, ganito ba yung tama kung iaayos? My self-restraint. Uh -huh. oh, ganito oh. ba yung tama kung sasabihin? Maga may awareness, mm -hmm. di ba? It's almost like just awareness. Yes. Even, uh, madalas din yung ginagamit, let's say, if you're into uh, dating or relationship or parang courtship level, mm -hmm. ah, demure mo na ganyan. Pero it's not naman na you're hiding who you are. Mm -hmm. It's just really of... Um, you being aware of where you will position yourself. Yeah. 
hindi ko pa naman to boyfriend, so dimir mo na ako. Kailangan ganito yung nagawin ko. So, those okay. kind of things. Yung mindfulness, coach, papano natin mapapractice itong mindfulness in every setting that we, we can find Whether in a workplace, in, whether you're school. a student, yeah, mm -hmm. or whether you're a mind, mother, it's a discipline. It's an everyday practice of being mindful. That, um, Like, let's say, uh, being positive. What you think good, you will speak good, you will say good, you will act good. Mm -hmm. So it's a discipline. It's an everyday that you will call yourself, ay teka. So, kumbaga, parang half day, oh teka, what I have done today that I think it's uh, not aligned to my so values. check reality. Check, reality check, check your, so yeah, reality. check yourself. Check. Teka, oh nga pala, I think I have said this. Okay, mm. well, how will I, you know, do mm. something to correct that or sa susunod paano yung pwede kong gawin na hindi na ganito ang approach ko o sasabihin ko. Ako, it uh, ang dating sa akin ng mindfulness is also being sensitive to mm. the people yeah. around you. Yes. What you say and how you act. How you diba? will affect them. Oh. Kasi that's very, especially sa parents, this generation, hindi na pe pwede yung you will just dictate and you know, compare something or say something to your young adolescents. Kumbaga, you have to be mindful that their voice matters, mm -hmm. their opinion mm -hmm. matters as well, and may maitutulong din naman yung sa mga magulang. Kung baga, ano yung mga thoughts nila or ideas nila. And being mindful is uh, giving us that um, approach that we are embracing the... We're not so self-centered. Yeah, it's not yeah, all about us. Yeah, yeah. We're diba? embracing the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the opinions of the young generation. We need to be sensitive. Yes, yes. also... Okay. Kasi minsan Hearing na their, uh, natin parang it's all it's all it's only about my you know my paniniwala my, it's my, about my, my opinions thoughts, my eh, na may social media mm. tayo at pwede nating uh, ilabas lahat ng mga saloobid natin uh, bahala na kung mayroong ma-offend yes. diba mm. this is also something that goes against the grain of what people are doing at the moment mm -mm. so it's very refreshing yes no? and in fact it's very not just refreshing it is very encouraging and uh, it enlightens everyone because it opens the door of um, being accepting, mm -hmm. uh, especially to positive criticism, where you can there's a space of growth and yes. improvement. That's nice, no? At the end of the day, kailangan natin yan. We uplift each other mm -hmm. and not to put anyone down yeah. and belittle anyone. Uh, kanina nabanggit ko, Coach, na marami nang gumagaya or gumagamit nito, mm. local, international mm. celebrities. Ano sa tingin mo yung nagiging effect nito sa kanila? Do they really know kung ano ba talagang ibig sabihin nito, Coach? Or sumasakay or, lang sa, sa cloud. Sa, diba? <laughs> yeah. sa trend. <laughs> sa trend. Oh. Pwede kasi una, sasakay ka lang sa trend. But if you're a person of wisdom, you will be mindful as well now. <laughs> na, ah, teka, ito nga pala yung ginagawa kong content. So mindful na ako sa sasabihin ko sa kasama ko sa trabaho, na hindi ako parang ano lang na magbibigay ng instructions, di ba? Oh, mindful na ako sa uh, anak ko, baka mamaya I'm just, you know, uh, dictating so many things without hearing out their opinions and their thoughts. Ah, demure na ako in terms of, you know, dealing with relationship. Hindi na ako yung kagaya ng before. I'm open to everything, to all of that until, you know, I made some realizations dahil nagkamali ako and all. So, I hope it's helping them out, not just sa content, because at the end of the day, marirear, ay, teka, ako ata yung sinasabi ko sa sarili kong to, ha? It's calling my attention also, di ba? Coach, any other final tips you can say to Arcadas about kung paano nila talaga mapapractice ang mga positive uh, qualities like being demure, mindful. being mindful. Yung cute si Likas na yan. <laughs> so, wala na tayong magagawa. Wala na tayong magagawa. Bigay na ni Hadi. Embedded na. Andyan na yan. Na yan. <laughs> 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 cherry on top na lang. Thank you so much, Kada. No? And thank you for having me once again. No? Uh, yan. Mga Kada, lagi lang nating uh, maging discipline or habit. Ang uh, positive reinforcement. Mm -hmm. We cannot give you know, um, we cannot give to others if our cup is empty of greatness and goodness. It should start from us. And that will, you know, of course, be a domino effect towards our family, our friends, our loved ones, our colleagues, and the people that surrounds us. And at the end of the day, it is not really uh, what you can show to the world, what you have, but your core, your heart, 
and your strength that matters. Thank you so much. And if I may say, ayan mga kada, should you think you need some assistance in transforming yourself, reinventing yourself to a better you, you can reach out to me, Coach Ellen Perez, in all of my social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you once again. again. Makanet 25, this is Pia Guanyumago. For more Kada Umaga updates, please click the subscribe button and follow us on Net25 social media pages at Net25 TV and at Net25 Entertainment Facebook page. See you guys. Bye.